Okay. So now we'll see the third program of first experiment of microcontroller laboratory. That is write an assembly language program to transfer five bytes of data within internal memory with overlap. Okay. So the code is here. Okay. So I got my code in the kill compiler. Okay. So save the file as file name .sm as usual. Attach the source code to the project. Check for syntax error. Okay. Check for syntax error. So make sure that the errors are zero. Once the errors are zero, go to the next step that is debug start session. Okay. So now since we have to provide the data in the internal memory. Okay. So internal memory location is 40H and 50H. So first we start entering the data at the location 40H. Okay. So to select the internal memory. I, uh, we have to uh, select D. D represents data memory. There is internal uh, me uh, data memory locations. 0x hexadecimal number system. As, uh, specifying the address. Okay. The location is 40. Okay. So starting from 40, we have to enter the data. Okay. So, uh, the we have to enter five bytes of data. Let us say, for example, starting from 40. My data is zero. You can take any data. Let's say one, two, three, four, and five. For example, okay. Starting from five location, and now next step is debug go. Okay. And what you can observe in the locate in this um, starting from location forty is from forty I enter one, two, three, four, five. But what we see now is in the locations forty, forty one, forty two, the data is one, two, and three, whereas Starting from 43 location, now the data is 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, which is the actual data copied at location starting from 40H. Okay? So, thereby this program indicates overlap of two memory locations, thereby resulting in loss of data. Okay? So, there is a program data transfer within internal memory with overlap, which actually results in loss of 